honoring a community leader who lost his battle with COVID. I said, are you ready to go see Jesus? And he nodded. His wife shares fond memories with us. Over and over, he's like, I want to tell people about Jesus. And I think he did that. A heartbreaking loss for this family and for the Central Lutheran School community in New Haven. They are mourning the loss of their principal tonight. Good evening, everyone. I'm Linda Jackson. And I'm Tom Powell. We're glad you're with us tonight. Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Carly Van Cleve talked to the principal's wife about his impact and her message going forward. Carly? Tom, Linda, a story tonight. John Weber was a principal, a father, and many say he was an inspiration to the community. COVID took his life far too soon at just 43 years old. And tonight his wife tells me she wants others to learn a lesson from his passing, that the pandemic is not over. He is a giant Husker fan. Sarah Weber was by her husband John's side for more than a year as he battled lung cancer. He was doing chemo and radiation and he thought he was you know, doing better. When not even a year after he was cancer free, he ended up back in the hospital with a serious case of COVID-19. He thought it was, you know, it was a sinus infection and he found out it was COVID. Sarah says because of the cancer, John was always at high risk. He didn't want to go back to the hospital. He was so sick of being, you know, in hospitals and poked and prodded. John was vaccinated and he caught a rare breakthrough COVID-19 case. And as soon as we got the chance to get a shot, he got his shot, I mean, because he wanted to be protected. He battled COVID for almost two months, part of that time on a ventilator with a chest tube, but his lungs weren't fully healed from the cancer. Saturday, that fight came to an end. I would like to know some of the things he was thinking. You know, I would like to, you're gonna make me cry. You know, say, I love you one more time. John was the principal at Central Lutheran School and Preschool in New Haven. You are loved and missed. His students and staff painted this rock in front of the school when he was first admitted to the ICU. You never think you have that kind of impact on people. And you never, I wish he could see all this before he died because he'd be like, all these people are here for me. Sarah says she believes her husband knew it was his time to go. I knew he was going to die and like several days before I had said, are you ready to go see Jesus? And he nodded. And she has a reminder for everyone. I think, you know, just, you know, being cautious, you know, getting vaccinated, I think that's important. You know, John never thought he was going to end up dying from this at all, but it happens. Powerful message there from his wife. Weber says students and staff at Central Lutheran School and preschool have been coping with their loss of the principal as well. She says they had some emotional support dogs in for the students today and the school will be closed Thursday and Friday for John Weber's visitation and funeral so everyone can pay their respects. The US government